here I am in this apartment, which is slightly messy, but not terrible. This is a temporary place. Um, we have the apartment or the condo in Kailua, and it is empty right now. We're going to move all of our stuff there, as you know. And it appears that the UPAC box is not going to arrive in time. Uh, this week, on Tuesday, right now it's Sunday, I'm leaving for Oahu, and um, the idea was that the container would be there or get there before I got there. But that's not what's going to happen. What's going to happen is I'm going to get there and have nothing to do. There'll be a few things there from when I left the last time, but there's not going to be anything there. So Sherry's going to be left with having to unpack everything. And as you can see, there's a bunch of crud behind me. That's my desk. And what's kind of left over. And most of that stuff is, is things I'm planning and using for the next few months. And I've been doing a lot of thinking, what's the best way to do one of these moves? I mean, yeah, you can totally cut the cord and you can just move. One day, just decide, that's it. I'm leaving. I'm moving. Everything's going. And I think that's great. But then on the other hand, it's probably better if you have a job, then you can figure out whether or not you have enough money and whether or not, you know, just where your finances are going to be. And so um, I'm thinking that that's the way it's going to work out for me is come January, I can make some kind of decision. I could say, okay, this is more expensive than I thought. It's not as expensive because you don't really know. I mean, I certainly don't know, which is the reason why I'm doing this video. I mean, at the end of the day, it's about money, time. It's about disappointments. Last week I checked with UPAC to see if the container was going to uh, arrive and they said it would arrive on next Friday. I checked today online and it said and it showed that it was still at the dock. So I think it missed whatever boat it was supposed to get on and even if it gets on a boat Monday there's no way it's making Friday and I leave to come back here to, to Seattle area Redmond on Sunday. So I won't be there when the shipment arrives. And hopefully Sherry's gonna be able to take care of this because it's possible that um, they won't release it to her, which would be terrible. So what am I gonna do in Hawaii this next trip? The car's gotta get registered. Um, I wanna put hand controls on the car for Sherry. She's probably gonna drive anyway, so that's not as important, but certainly registering is gonna be important. So maybe get some beds. I'll get the internet connection working because my life is on the internet. But the TV's not going to be working. I called the cable company there, Oceanic, and they are reasonable enough. Um, I'll do 20 megabits download speed. I, I think that's going to be a little bit slow, but I'll start with that. Now, how to go faster? I think I'll get rid of the cable. I don't know. I mean, I'll get rid of uh, television, and I'll keep the internet package. So anyway, this is a temporary place. This is a, a monthly rental. Um... It's expensive. It's right next to Microsoft Campus, uh, Timberlawn Apartments. I'm paying 2000 for the month. And like I said, that's expensive. I wouldn't recommend doing it except, you know, it was a hotel or this. And I was just like, this It's fine. I'd rather be comfortable. I've got cable. It, it's supposed to have internet, but the internet is terrible. It's awful. There's no... Next week, I'll be on a plane, Tuesday. Um, I have to do a bunch of work tomorrow. I have a friend visiting tomorrow. Already, I have friends lined up who want to visit Hawaii. Uh, one of my friends, but I went to a birthday party yesterday um, at the casino. There's no casinos in Hawaii. And um, I think my friend wants to come visit for Christmas, which will be fun. So um, I'll be there on Christmas. Okay. This is it right now. Some disappointments. Not really sure. Kind of in limbo. This is this is what limbo looks like. For me.